sins were forgiven. En natuurlijk ook zijn grootste zonden werden vergeven. En hier was also one of them. He was so thankful to God. En hij was zo dankbaar naar God toe. He was so humble. Hij was zo nederig. That he also he started a church. En hij begon een kerk. Even under the danger of getting killed. En met het gevaar dat hij wel eens omgebracht zou kunnen worden. Halleluja. Halleluja. Oh, I met also in, the, in February this year. Of in February had ik ook iemand ontmoet. I met a, a Mexican pastor. Een Mexicaanse voorganger. And he was a former Satanist. And he was a voormalige Satanist. And he served Satan. And he served Satan. And he served Satan. And he Satanists are also all over the world. And Satan is overall in the world. Even here in Netherlands, you have Satanists. Selfs in 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 Nederland heb je ook Satanisme. And they, by full will, they decide. And by full will, they decide. And by full will, they decide. To do to save uh, to serve Satan and to. Satan to dine and. And to allow Satan to use their lives to destroy many people's lives. And om hun levens te gebruiken om andere levens te vernietigen. And he was one of them. And he was one of them. And so they are really tough people. They are echt ja ruwe mensen. But uh, in Mexico right now, there's a there's a lot of gangsters going on, a lot of bandits. And but in Mexico now there are a whole group of these crime bandits and. Uh, uh, mafia mensen. There's uh, drug cartels. Er zijn uh, gewoon hele cartels voor drugs. So there are some people even worse than him. Er zijn uh, mensen die zijn uh, misschien nog erger als hem. And he got kidnapped by them. Maar hij werd door hem gekidnapped. As another mafia gang kidnapped him. Dus een andere mafia bende die had hem uh, gegijzeld, gekidnapped. And he was as a, in prison with some other people in the Chandel area in Mexico. And he was with a number of other prisoners in a prison. And yeah, and and they were waiting to to get money together to get free. And so they were waiting on the wait for money to get free. And so they were waiting on the wait for money to get free. And so they were dus deze mensen die op die losse uh, uh, losprijs zaten te wachten, die hem gekidnapt hebben, hadden, die haten ons gewoon. Also if if the people could not get the money together to get them free what they demanded. Dus als ze niet de losprijs kregen voor degenen die ze gegijzeld hadden. Also they killed then the prisoners. Ja, dan uiteindelijk uh, vermoorden ze gewoon die uh, mensen die ze gegijzeld gekidnapt hebben. But they did not kill it just the regular way. Maar ze doden dan niet op een gewone manier. Also they torture them a few days. Ze gaan eerst een paar dagen martelen. I, I don't want to go in details. Ik wil niet in details gaan. And at the end they just put them on a burning fire and let them burn. En dan aan het eind dan gooien ze hem gewoon op een brandende stapel. As a Mexico people can be like this. I mean the. Dus Mexicaanse mensen kunnen echt zo. The gangsters. The gangsters. Also and so also and this pastor. And this forgammer. He was not a pastor yet. He was not too much in forgammer. He was also in his prison in the jungle. He was in the in the in the prison house in the in the jungle where he was gejailed. And he also he told me his testimony. He told me his testimony. And he said suddenly. He said suddenly. In a vision, God came to me. And a vision from God to me. And God was holding me in the Bible. And so like in a vision there. And God held me down the Bible for in his hand. And God said to him, "You, you can preach my word." And God said to him, "You can my word preach." And he, he was so perplexed and surprised. And he was helemaal verrast en overdonderd. But finally, he accepted this offer from God. Maar uiteindelijk heeft hij deze oproep, deze aanbod van God geaccepteerd. And he got saved alone in his. Prison in the bamboos, uh, whatever house in the and jungle. And in his uppie, then, that he got saved in the middle of the jungle. But he was so surprised and so touched also by the love of God. But he was so touched and also by the love of God. Because he could not understand it. Because he could not understand it. Why did God come to him? Why did God come to him on that way? Because he, God knows also I'm a Satanist. But he thought, "Yeah, but I'm the last. I'm the Satanist." I am one of the worst people on earth. I am one of the worst people on earth. But God did it. But God did it. Came to him. He came to him. He came to him. And said, "Yeah, you can serve me." And he said, "Can you come and dine?" Wow, he was. He said, "I was so touched." He said, "I was so touched." And then when he accepted Jesus, then. And when Jesus ontving and accepted him. Alone in his in his prison. In his eentje in de gevangenis. Of course, uh, he 
He became also so thankful to God. Natuurlijk werd hij toen ook heel erg dankbaar naar God toe. Because my, he knows Satan. Want hij weet, hij kent Satan. And he knows that he was on the way to hell. En hij wist dat hij onderweg was naar de hel. And so for him is not only imagination. Dus het is voor hem is niet alleen een uh, idee of een verbeelding. And so he, he knows Satan personally. Hij kent Satan persoonlijk. But he said he, he was so touched. Maar hij zei ik was zo aangeraakt. That God offered me to be with him in heaven. Dat God me aanbood om met hem te zijn in de hemel. Even I am one of the worst people on earth. Omdat ik een van de ergste uh, mensen ben hier op aarde. And because of this. En omdat dit gebeurde, and also his big pile of sins were forgiven, en zijn berg van zonden vergeven waren, he also is one of the Christians today who is so thankful to God. Hij is een van de christenen die zo dankbaar is naar God toe. Out of this thankfulness, out of this love, vanuit he, deze dankbaarheid, vanuit deze liefde, he said, I'm going to serve God all my life. Zei hij van, ik zal mijn, mijn leven lang God dienen. No way that I go back to the world. Geen, uh, uh, on, 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 geen twijfel eraan dat ik terug, uh, nooit terug zal keren naar de wereld. And he started a church in South Mexico. En hij is een kerk begonnen in Zuid Mexico. Halleluja. 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 And we can see this, also how to say, we can see this many times in the world when especially very heavy criminals come to Jesus. En we kunnen dit vaak zien als uh, hele erge criminelen tot Jezus komen. And their big pile of sins will be forgiven. En een berg van zonde hun vergeven worden. They are really the most thankful Christians on earth to God. Dan zijn ze de meest dankbare christenen hier op aarde. That's why Jesus says, whom is much forgiven loves much. Daarom zegt Jezus, wie veel is vergeven, die heeft ook veel liefde. And whom is little forgiven loves little. En wie maar een klein beetje vergeving heeft ontvangen, die heeft ook maar een klein beetje liefde. Somehow this is a Human is our human nature. Ja, een of andere manier is dit onze menselijke natuur. It is like this. Het is gewoon uh, zoals dit. But however, maar en desondanks, I mean, uh, not everybody has the same pile of sins in life, which niet iedereen heeft een grote berg van dezelfde even hoeveelheid van zonde, which has been forgiven. Dat dat vergeven is. However, if if you as a Christian You you feel that you do not love God so much anymore. Maar toch als jij als christen als ervaart dat je niet meer zoveel van God houdt, still can God still God can give you love. Toch alsnog kan God je liefde geven. Because God says also in the Bible. Want God zegt in de Bijbel. Ask it shall be given to you. Vraag en het zal u gegeven worden. As if you feel that your heart is 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 uh, got a bit cold towards God. Dus als je ervaart en voelt dat je hart een beetje koud is voor naar God toe, you can ask him to give you even love for him. Dan kunt u hem zelfs vragen om uh, meer liefde van hem van hem te houden. And if you if you do this, en als je dit doet, he will he will give you more love for dan him. Dan zal hij je meer liefde geven voor hem. Halleluja. 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 As we also we need to ask many times. Dus zo moeten wij ook vaak vragen, vaker. But basically, Jesus says. Maar ten diepste zegt Jezus. Whoever experiences my love. Wie mijn liefde ervaart. In a high measure. In een grote mate. Also will love me back in a high measure. In dezelfde grote mate zal je mij lief hebben, zegt Jezus. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Mijn God. Well, I think it's time to pray. Ik denk dat het tijd is om te bidden. Can maybe the worship crew uh, come? Kan de bidding team komen? the Holy Spirit and, and pray for you. Is there anybody here who, who doesn't know Jesus yet? Is there anyone here who asks the question who doesn't know Jesus yet? Is there anybody here? You